Yo, what's happening? YouTube Jugget here. Welcome back to another Tiny Tina Wonderlands video. Please watch this video in its entirety because there's going to be a lot of cool showcases. I'm going to highlight some of the modded weapons. I'm going to let you guys know what modded means against handcrafted items. But nevertheless, I'm going to explain everything in this video. So please watch it in its entirety. Secondly, I just want to thank you guys so much for continuing to support the shop week in and week out. I do want to apologize because the shop has not been open as much as it should but i do try to open it weekly as much as i can for you guys so thank you guys so much for still being here as i provide these services for you until the programs are ready to go so i can create handcrafted items for you guys so right now there will be these packages and tiny tina wonderlands until everything is finalized so i can have individual items but yes they are on their way thirdly i just want to thank you guys so much for all the love messages that you guys send me um this week has been crazy i was in the er again for covid like symptoms i'm still under the weather but i am recovering and I do have a sore throat so sorry that I sound a little bit raspy but yes I am getting better and thank you guys so much for being here because every little messages you guys send me keeps me going <laughs> anyways let's get into the video right now so there are going to be two packages in the shop this weekend they're going to be the light package and the plus package of the infinite legendary drops chaos level 35 lobby experiences so the plus package you guys are looking at right now and the light package you guys are looking at right now the difference between both packages is basically you're going to get more items Items. in the plus package the plus package is really cool because you're gonna get a little bit more cooler items nevertheless in the light package you're still gonna get some really awesome items but this package is for those people that still want to experience the lobby and still get some really cool items along the way so if you are balling on a budget this is for you but if you want to splurge the chaos level 35 plus package is for you nevertheless i'm trying to support as many people as i can with different various budgets so you guys can still have some really awesome experiences within the shop and within the game so this is the disclaimer part of the video first and foremost what you guys are paying for are the lobby experiences you guys will see what the lobby experiences towards the end of the video and how much fun you guys are going to have with me as we experience that together with the infinite legendary drops you guys are actually getting these modded items for free because you guys are purchasing that package i will never resell other people work and these are modded items you're not handcrafted items the difference between handcrafted items and modded items modded items are made by the community handcrafted items are made by me and even though they're still modded there have to be a distinction between both of them so you guys understand where they are coming from okay you guys will actually get some magical items as well just want to give two shout outs the first shout out is from money 420 on playstation he actually hooked me up with one of these items to give to you guys so i appreciate you and thank you so much if you're going to come back this weekend because we're going to have so much fun you already know what it is you experienced this with me and you said yes this is what the community is going to love and thank you so much for helping me to push this uh, packages this weekend also second shout out i want to give a shout out to nexus because i want you guys to understand that i will give credit where credit is due and this is where i got most of these items from you guys are going to see the lobbies towards the end and it's going to be really amazing for you but first let's get into the showcase of some of these items right here right now this melee weapon is really super fun i do love it a lot the design is really nice again i will give credit where credit is due um the design is really nice and i do love that when you melee the slashes is going towards your screen it's gonna hit the enemy they're really super fast there's no elemental slam ability which is okay but nevertheless the damage is really nice on it and i love the slashes through the sky and i think that's a really awesome feature especially with the abilities of that item next up we have this amazing ring which is really awesome i like the design a lot because it's really colorful it's like something i would wear in real life but what makes this item stand out is that stat of the loot luck pushing you over 1700 percent which is awesome if you bought the plus package you will actually get two of these and i believe they do stack in your ring slots which is even more better for you guys to experience the drops in this game because that loot luck is everything in this game and having that bonus stat is really nice next up we have the underlying infused eagle eye charm 
Now, remember in Borderlands 3, I used to have my fams, Flak, Amara, Mo, Zane items, which is a combination of everyone within one item. This goes for this. Now, we are going to create something new. called BCGSSS or BCG Triple S. What that means is Berserker, Clawbringer, Graveborn, Spellshot, Spore Warden, and Stabomancer. All of those characters combined into one item. So you guys can use it on all of your characters again, just like fams. Now we have BCGSSS. Next up, we have this beautiful class mod. Now this modded item, I have tons of modded class mods for you guys that does has crazy incredible skills for your characters. So if I can match you up with one of these class mods for your character, you will receive that. But if I don't have one for your character, I will actually just give you a random one. But it will actually be for either one of your multi-classes. But like I said, I have tons of them and I will try my best to match you up with what um, I have for your character. Now, you guys see all the crazy skill points going across the screen just now previously. It's because you guys will get extra abilities for those skill points which is really cool now the way it works from different from borderlands 3 you have to actually unlock that tier in order to get the bonus stats of those items so it's a little bit different but i think it's actually pretty cool because you don't want everything to be the same like borderlands 3 and tiny tina wonderlands so you have to go down the tiers to unlock those slots to get those abilities of the class mod next up we have this twister of rejuvenation spell i think it's really cool i do like this a lot i like the shiny gold first and foremost because you you know gold shines and seeing it in the game is really cool especially when it glitters and glimmers is really awesome now when you actually uh, use this ability you guys can actually see glitter and glimmer coming out of your hands in a beautiful spell this is really fun kind of reminding me of kamehameha and just a magical spell this is not the magical item we will talk about the magical items coming up here shortly but this spell is a must have especially if you really want to experience the game differently from the other spells that they have in the base game this modded item is really cool Cool. let's take a look at it a little bit more in depth when you go into photo mode i mean just look at this beautiful the electric the clouds it's just it's nimbus cloud you know it's just really nice and i think you guys will actually appreciate this um whoever made this on nexus you know you did an amazing job on this because this is something like i would make so i do appreciate your creativity on that next up we have this beautiful divergent shotgun i do like the design on this as well i think you guys are gonna have fun with this this is only available in the plus package and this shotgun is really cool not only only because the cryo effect when you shoot it it looks super awesome but when you do reload it does have an effect like um the theodore you actually throw out a big cryo dice and i think you guys are gonna have fun with that because it's really awesome and you can actually shoot it and still do damage around the enemies which is pretty fun so i did want to offer this to you guys as well so this will be in the chaos plus package and go ahead and have fun with it because it's really cool to have and i believe it's a one shot so be careful with it if you're not trying to one shot things but if you're having a hard time in the chaos chamber this will actually help you to get through it a little bit easier and it's a fun item so not only you're going through the chaos chamber to get to level 35 but you're having a fun time doing it with this item so it will help you so creates that balance of a little you know a little bit easiness but at the same time it's a little bit fun because it is a one shot weapon and it will get you where you're trying to get which is maximizing the level and the difficulty of this game while having fun at the same time. So that's a really cool item right there. Next up, we have the two magical items I'm about to showcase for you guys, the cosmetic items. This one is the first one you will find in the light package, which is pretty cool. Now, you guys can see my character right there. She looks like she's wearing pajamas, but that's actually when you create a character in this game, that's the base cosmetic that what your character can look like. And depending on what items you have on it changes the way that your character looks. Now, this magical item you guys are looking at is really cool. It's a little bit funky this is why you guys can find it in the light package but it's really awesome because when you actually wear this item you know your friends are gonna be like oh my god what are you wearing like i said it's a little janky because the texture is missing on the back of one of the capes she has on like four capes which is really insane but it looks so awesome your character looks really badass especially from the front this is an invisible cosmetic legendary item so when you actually do have it on and you do pick it up make sure you guys actually attach it because it's going to be invisible in the air so just make sure you guys grab that but i just want to showcase right here the magical cosmetic item you guys are looking at is really cool like i said she looks amazing from the front she looks totally badass and you know she looks she's ready to go and you guys are gonna have so much fun 
you know, showcasing this to your friends because they're going to want it even though the back is kind of janky. Nevertheless, it's a really cool cosmetic item to have. You guys can see what she looked like before. Looking like she has on pajamas. Now she looks like she has on a full gear. Looking like Alloy from Horizon Zero Dawn. Now talking about Horizon Zero Dawn, the next item up is a notch not a magical item but this one is a little different now check this out you guys can see i just detached the item from my character and there it goes invisible in the air so make sure you guys actually pick that up now when you actually pick this up and attach it you guys will get that beautiful cosmetic look of your character which is fun and really awesome now you guys can see in the background of this video that my character is being updated in the statues and look how more beautiful she looks in the diamond statue with that cosmetic item on. next up we have another magical cosmetic item Item. if you have the chaos level 35 plus package you will actually get both of these magical cosmetic items now the next cosmetic magical item you guys are gonna be looking on has some stats on it bcg triple s which is you guys know what that stands for right now and it has some beautiful stats for your character the other magical item didn't have any stats and it was invisible this one here is a beautiful class mod that has a magical cosmetic plus to it plus beautiful stats that you guys can actually appreciate and i think you guys are gonna have more fun with this because this is not broken in any which way where there's no missing textures or anything and she still does look badass and she does still look like alloy with this crazy cosmetic magical item class mod on now i'm gonna actually detach this item and drop it on the floor so you guys can see the big difference of how it actually looks with it on and off so this is with it off you guys can see she still looks like she's wearing her pajamas but when you actually put this item on she does still look super badass plus you get those bcg triple s bonus stats for all of your characters which is awesome so you can actually swap it out to each individual one of your characters and still have super fun picking it up you guys can see my diamond statue got updated again and she still looks super cool and I just think it's really awesome to have something like this because you guys are going to have fun, not only with, you know, looking super badass, but you're actually going to have those bonus stats. Next up, let's talk about how these lobbies are going to work. This is the main part of the actual video. So I'm actually going to start the level at Chaos Level 35. You're going to join me. I'm going to drop all these items for you guys before we actually start. And you're going to go into the lobby with me, into the game, Level 35 Chaos Chamber, with an empty backpack so you guys can pick up as many legendaries as you can because this lobby will be infinite legendary drops and yes it will be at the highest level in the game so not only you're getting free modded items but you will be getting legit items at the same time for your character so you have the option of running it however you would like i love to give you guys options so you guys can play how you like when you want and however you just see fit to enjoy this game now you guys can pick up as many legendary items as you want that your backpack will allow you to fill so when you guys do join my lobby make sure you guys Put all those modded items in your bank so when we start the game you have a free backpack you can pick up any of these legendary items it could be anything from regular legendary even to primordial all the way up volatile chaotic you know if you are lucky enough you guys will actually have some of these really cool items and you guys can have tons of fun with it i will give you guys three minutes in between each teleport so you guys can have you know a little bit of time to go through each item so you guys can see what you want to pick up because they're going to be infinite legendary drops as we go along the way these lobbies are going to last anywhere between 10 minutes to 35 minutes um because you know you guys really need to look at the items because you might see something that you really want i'm just pick it up and make sure you when you guys actually finish the lobby that your backpack is entirely full with nothing but legendaries now when we actually get towards the end of the game you guys will actually get all these bonus crystals that you guys will be able to use used and i want you guys to use them and i'm gonna show you guys how to use them here shortly now just so you guys know these lobbies are optional as well so if you bought a package and you do not want to play these lobbies to get these legendary items you have the option to tell me in a message hey jug um i would just like the modded items i don't want the lobby even though i know i'm paying for the lobby i just want the items because i'm busy today or my schedule doesn't permit me to play for 30 you know five minutes with you um but i'm going to skip the lobby and just take the modded items which is fine with me as well like i said i love to give you guys options and how you see fit to play this game and with your schedule so you can opt out of not having the lobby and still receive the items either way you're getting the items regardless just want to make that clear so now how the crystals are going to work towards the end you are going to use 500 crystals 
per each you know whatever item you want in uh, this game towards the end for example if you want an smg you know you're gonna go to the smg rabbit and you're gonna hold down the button to feed the rabbit 500 crystals at a time because it has a high percent chance of dropping nothing but legendaries as well so this is another bonus that you're gonna get within the lobby make sure you are feeding those rabbits 500 crystals per turn you know so they can spit out these items and again you have a high chance of getting these volatile chaotic primordial items or regular legendaries but they will be legendaries which is super awesome so you guys will get at the end a bonus treat for even joining these lobbies so which is super awesome so you guys know i will spend a little bit more time with you guys in the end here so you guys can actually go through these rabbits and you know hopefully get something really cool so i'm gonna spend about three to five minutes in this room before we head back to the chaos chamber and we disconnect and i can move on to the next order so thank you guys so much for being here this was a crazy video and it was really super fun to make Sorry for it being late. I have been really busy and plus I was sick this week, but I am ready to work. So put your order in and let's get this going. Again, it could be anywhere between instant to five days for delivery, depending on what order you fall in. When your order was placed, it is first come first serve. And this is a limited service. So I will try to bring it back next week for those people that couldn't get it this week. And as we, you know, move forward to handcrafted loot, here coming up very soon so until next time treat yourself don't cheat yourself i'm jug love you guys to the fullest and i'll see you here for another one peace